gonna check out the Wonder Crown Gallery. I actually had a request to fully showcase this shop. So I wanted to make sure that I did that. Abel said he loves this shop and I agree. What I really like and that I think is unique is they'll offer a print in multiple different styles. So say you like this Peter Pan print but don't want to spend the $295 on the canvas, you can often find postcards. So they're definitely more affordable, they're $4.99. Uh, but sometimes they even have them, yeah, like this. See, so then you can just opt for just the matting and then you can frame it on your own at home. Um, this one is $39.99, right, $40 versus almost $300. Might be the way to go. So here's the register where you'll check out. They have more of the postcards here by the register. Like, look at this one. The Pocahontas and Miko. I actually have several postcards um, in our room on one of those photo boards that is just the foam board with ribbon across it that you can put photos in. I've got a couple prints up there because I think that that's a really easy way to display these and they're just so fun. Look at this lady in the tramp one. Every time I come here, I find like five more that I want. We are. Yeah, I, I ordered it. It is, yes. Yeah, there's unique ones on there. Got some haunted mansion ones. So neat. From Beauty and the Beast, yeah. Isn't it cute? I know. I just love this print. It's so fun. Dodger. Yep. It's re it's really unique because I think you normally see you know like everybody knows Doug and yeah. the more iconic ones, but I like that they kind of featured some more obscure ones. They're very cool. Look at this print. <gasps> I need this one. I need it. We also have the smaller prints up here. Those are sixteen ninety nine. Yeah, it's typical for their mugs. Fifteen ninety nine, sixteen ninety nine. I'm thinking about the story, so I think it's kind of random because they have. Some of the prints with magnets, some of the prints have t-shirts. Right. Um, I was explaining that. They like come in different styles. So like this absolutely. Jasmine one, you can get it framed, you can get it on a postcard, or you can get it and just the matting. Um, but I actually said I like that because if you can't afford the $350 painting, you, you could get the $4.99 postcard. Right. Yeah, for sure. So it definitely offers options for people. Um, right. So it is kind of random. Now this is def this style is definitely not my style. I'm not one. I don't really pr like the um, princesses depicted in this way. But that's the beauty about art is art is in the you know eye of the beholder. Her beauty is in the eye of the beholder. So just because I don't like it doesn't mean it's not popular. It's weird to see Ariel like not smile. Yes, it is a very kind of creepy look. Um, yeah, the magnets are $9.99, or $9.95, sorry. But then they also have these ones that are kind of cool, these hanging ones. Really so, cute, like on a skinny wall or something. Yeah. And these are $24.95. I mean, I guess for Ursula it makes sense because she's a villain. I like that one, actually. Um, they make her look sexy and beautiful. Yeah. Um, look, there's Ray. Blair, something awful. Ray and BB-8. I love this collection. Look at Doug, man. And they had some of these out at um, the art festival this year. These are fun. Me on the second one. Like these little small roll. I know that's my husband up the air. And these ones are cute. Has the three caballeros. Dreamfinder with figment. These are $14.99. And then they do have the up magnet as well. So cute. They have a Tervis. 
which is really nice. Look how cute this small world $19.99. Oh, so cute. I get that in a journal. $16.99. And I love this portrait. I wish that they had her with blonde hair. Because I feel like that could be Abel and I. Um, in the same print, they also have the socks, which is really cool. And you can see like Rare Rabbit, the castle. Mickey Pretzel, Sword in the Stone, just some classic Fantasyland icons. Here's some more hipster art. Hipster Mickey. Very cute. Shirt that matches. They've got a cell phone case too. He's actually like a security locked on there. Yeah, mom's right. Some come with shirts, some come with magnets. Just depends on, I guess, which one you like the best. That one's just really cheery. Having a good time at the kingdom. Here's some more um, postcards. So, like, here's the. Um, there we go. This one's really cute because it's the kingdom of cute. This is Disneyland. I always think it's funny when you see Disneyland stuff at Disney World. <laughs> I love that one. I, th I feel like I've seen that one before. You didn't like the eyes, I think. Yeah, there's something a little off about her artistically, but it's beautiful. There's that print again. I love this one with Moana and Pua. Oh my gosh! Small way. It's a small way to go to get and again, great souvenirs. They've got the more dark style. I go to. This one, it's like it has all the hidden characters in it. We've seen that one before. That's really cool. Stitch. He's cute. He's got a big old head. Thirty-nine ninety-nine. This is cute, mom. Look at it's like ombre, blue to pink at the bottom. It's fun because this print also has the magnets. They have the poster. Oh, they have a Marie. And a figment and the same design. So they'll often feature the artist as well, which is really cool. Because um, that's what's unique about this store specifically is it's all different featured artists. Um, so like this example is Kaylee Hicks. So you can tell, you know, kind of her style right away versus this one down here, you know? So depending on where you are, this is show, a race, see here's more. And again, it features the artist. So just kind of what style you like. Now, Ashley Taylor, I follow her on Instagram um, and I've actually communicated with her. I came here wanting to come to the Her Universe book signing um, and she had commented about something about the signing on her story and I commented that I wasn't able to um, get a wristband so I didn't end up waiting in line. But she encouraged me to come to the Barnes & Noble book signing. She just was so, so sweet. So I just love everything that she does. Here's more of the Rapunzel. They also have the huge canvases, like I showcase outside. Like that bell in the library is two ninety five. I love it. This artist, I think that's Jeremiah Kettner. Uh huh. His are beautiful. And I really like this one too, Whitney Pollett, with the almost like the. Um, what am I trying to say? There's like portraits of them, and with this one, it's really cool. It comes with a compact. Which is a very unique gift. These ones you can get shirts. Um, and it comes in a little $16.99. What's neat is it's kind of a glitter wow, fabric. Wow, that's beautiful. With that same portrait. Ooh, we hold up that small so I can see it. It's a nice oh, it's a tank? Oh, it's a tank top, okay. And it's $34.99. Nice it's tank. It's kind of pricey for a tank top. But yeah. It's really cute. That's very cool. Very, very cool. I love that. I'm gonna get you. Well, I wanted to 
show you putting it back because people like to see me putting things back. I know. I'm just being a turkey. I, I mean, I love this one. This one's by far my favorite. I have such a special connection with Up. Um, it was actually meant to be our wedding. We hold it up so I can see it. It was actually meant to be our wedding theme. I ended up changing it to just Fiesta because I could just still kind of get that same thing with the different colors. It's a weird, like, shark bite hem. Um, but Abel and I, were, I'm sure if you guys have followed me, we're both wilderness explorers, so just Animal Kingdom and up, and sorry it didn't focus in time, um, $34.99. I just love that. I don't like that design of that shirt, but I love that print. Hey, you're wearing it, it looks so different. Yeah, you never know. That's true. Here's the lady in the tramp. It's that postcard I showed you. They've got it in the canvas and the mat. I love this shirt. I think Abel, Abel likes these like touristy, crazy print. Like the John lasseter -esque. Yeah. These ones are 85. And I don't, I don't know about this one. The texture feels, it's not soft. It's not a soft. Ooh, sorry. You're good, go ahead. Because he was looking at the bigger one. Really. Here's more of the pirate stuff. So they've got, I mean, these are cool. This is the scene in the ride. The guy balancing, the pirate balancing all the hats. And then, and then like goblet mugs. That's very cool. See uh, the guests on the boat. Twenty two ninety nine. So that's kind of like that is that kind of same style of mug over there. And then these shirts are the same print. The pirate with balancing the hats. Of course, they have these. I think these would be amazing if you had a media room, or you know, uh, or even if you have. Um, a room maybe like a guest room or a bathroom that's themed these would be amazing focal points on the wall and these are $3.95 like that one's so cute look at Dopey on the ride with the little girl being scared by the witch and then this one has a pillow in the mad tea party this one actually has a book too a journal that's really cool uh, it's closed, but it's $16.99. So, has to be a, a notebook. And then look right. at the fun shirt. Oh, oh I, I actually really that. like that uh, shirt. That's really cute. It's really cute. Then they also, again, have the mats of the photos. This one, though, includes Splash Mountain, which the larger one did not. And then again, they have these ones that are displayed on a ribbon, so you can hang these, like my mom said, like three down a skinny wall or something. Here's the Splash Mountain one. And then they also have the drinking glasses. The, these are all $14.99. And they've got Splash, and Tiki Room, and Snow White. And then to complement the glasses, they also have the coasters. So I imagine this would be a really good gift set for somebody that is moving into a new home, like a, um, you know, a new home gift, $29.99. You can get them a set of glasses and coasters for their house, um, a couple getting married. There's a lot of instances where you could, I think that that would be a really sweet set. Um, they had this postcard I showed you already. They also have it in the magnet and the canvas. Um, so definitely if you see a style art piece that you like, my biggest takeaway is look around. You'll probably see that same art piece in several different options, whether that be on the mat individual matting, magnets, t-shirts, you just never know. And you might walk away with a print that you love, not necessarily on a big canvas, if that's not what you're wanting. Or you could get this one which is called Walt's Dream by Greg Vicentainer, and it's 495. Not bad. I mean, for the size of the print, but truly. It's amazing, because look, you can see Mickey. Yeah, so this whole art piece, there's hidden Here's images within it. This one says Walt Disney, in Walt Disney. Here's Minnie. Here's Minnie. I mean, you could stand here for hours. I feel like this is something that was like a tail or something. Yeah, yeah I don't know what that oh, wait, is. Here's upside down. Um, oh, mom, it's a face. It's a face. This is hair, eyes, eyebrows, a nose, lips. 
Yep. Pluto, right here. World His feet. And look, here's yesterday, tomorrow. Oh yeah, you're right, look. I think most of what I want, I think most of what I want Disneyland to be a happy place. And here's a monorail. Well, and here's Disneyland. Look. D I S N E Y L A N D. So yeah. you could just look at this for hours. Ever. I think all of the prints are like that. Abel and I were looking in the Animal Kingdom one one time. And we stood, it was right here, remember? We stood here for forever. This is a really cool one too. It's Haunted Mansion. It's almost like a map. Right. Yeah, so you can see like where he's trying to get out of the coffin, Madame Leota's house, not her house, her room, the dancing ballroom, this is my favorite scene in the ride, the graveyard with grim gritting ghosts, the stretching portraits room, that's really cool. And I think though, these are probably my favorite, like aesthetically these ones are the ones I love because I like sweet, you know, sweet princess type things. I actually have that Moana and the Snow White as a postcard. But they also have the matting and the canvas. This is by artist Nisa Boy. Boy. Nisa Boy. Oh, fuck, I'm sure I did not do her any justice on her name. That's my favorite. These ones, yeah, are Abel's favorite. They are very Victorian. They're very, like, elaborate. Queen. Even just on the Evil Queen, you can see that her frame is made up of the cards, the white rabbit, and her dress. Yeah, Corella has the dogs. And again, they have the shirt, but only for Maleficent for this one. This is a nice, comfy feeling shirt. I'll wear it if it was a man's, but it's not. That one's $36.99. I was telling Very you, they cool. can make some really good pens out of these. I mean, all of these would be amazing. I would buy all of those pens over there. I mean, these ones. Um, so that's kind of like an overview. I highly recommend coming in here, checking it out. There's always stuff changing. Um, shift, stock shifts pretty quickly. So you feel like you're, every time you come in here, there's something different. I wanted to show you to the outside. Um, just because I think it's cool. I like the concept that they did with the dripping paint, but also there's more of the, yeah, that haunted, the same from the Haunted Mansion. They've got different ones. So they did a Trader Sam's. This is Snow White's Scary Adventure, and you can see the Evil Queen at the top, which is really cute. They have Mr. Toad's Wild Ride. So these are definitely Disneyland classic attractions, because we don't have Mr. Toad's or Snow White here. Here's the Haunted Mansion one that I showed you matte and postcard form. This is by artist Katie Cook. Um, the Trader Sam's is just like stinking cute. And here are the larger ones. Again, the frames run from around $250. Um, so I would personally do like the matting, those are $40. Um, or the postcards are really fun too because they're easy to collect. Lots of pieces of art that way because they're $5. Um, Oh, I didn't see this shirt. That one's cute. Little Alice. I didn't see that one in there. Um, but that's it for Wonderland. Wonderground, sorry, gallery. Very cool.